our six-day West Coast road trip. Sixers back home in the city of brotherly love with two more in the win column and a whole lot more on the line tonight. Joel Embiid with his eyes on a potential MVP award as well as the top seed in the Eastern Conference. Former MVP Giannis Adetokounmpo and the Bucks. Well, wouldn't you know it, Olive? They're focused on those exact same things. It is the regular season rubber match between a couple of the top teams, not just in the East, the entire NBA. We're bringing you Sixers Bucks tonight right here on NBC Sports of Philadelphia. Welcome inside the Wells Fargo Center, everyone. Ala and Kate, so happy to be back home with you. And Ala, two games between these two already in the books this year. Joel took care of business in Milwaukee last game before the All-Star break. And then way back in November without Joel Embiid, Giannis led the Bucks to victory. One former MVP, one soon-to-be, fingers crossed, MVP <laughs> going up against each other. Two contrasting styles, yet both are elite big guys. Giannis with a more face-up-to-the-basket kind of game. He wants to attack put the ball on the floor he doesn't rely as much on the jumper as Joel does he is capable of knocking down medium range but you'd be happy if he was taking threes and our big fella he's got the complete package he can knock down threes this is in February in Milwaukee you see him knocking down numbers of them the ability to knock down threes and stretch the defense is key the 76ers have to space the floor well for him to get looks like that tonight Let's take a look now, Allah, at our Nerd Wallet standings. Eight games for both of these teams to go in the NBA regular season. All tied up at 46 and 28 on the season. So this is a big one for multiple reasons. The Heat clinging to that one game lead and the Celtics just percentage points behind. Oh, what an end to the regular season this is going to be. And tonight, we got a battle for the scoring title, the MVP award, seeding in the East, a tiebreaker advantage. So much coming up tonight. Stay with us.